live from a little corner of Austin, where we want to throw our own water in the air, and Brian's kicking Bonnie out next week, it's going to be a great night. Now, this dude could blow up a building while we're succeeding downward, because here are your hosts, Brian Brushwood and Justin Robert Young! Look at you! Look at you! So brave! Oh, shit. So brave! So brave! You're, you're like, like you're, you're not even afraid, are you? Hell no, I'm not afraid. Well, I'm ready. I, oh, I mean, really? Ready? I mean, for the let's the, go the whole thing. Let's fucking go! All of it, the whole I, enchilada. Yeah. Let's go. Okay, I wasn't supposed to bring this up so early, but okay. Um, uh, they told me that you might need a little bit of, yeah. you know... A little bit, little bit of perv? A uh, little bit of squad to beef? No worries, dog. I brought it all, my guy. Uh, well, I'm here... Truckload. I'm here to... Beep! 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 <laughs> squad to weep, to, to beef delivery. <laughs> Look, my supervisor... That's part of it. <laughs> no. My supervisor told Nick me... Nick type spice. <laughs> you... you. <laughs> <laughs> That's a one person joke, everybody. Uh, one person. You might <laughs> you might I was told you may be interested. Yeah. It just I might be! <laughs> I yeah. might be, motherfucker! <laughs> In just a little bit. A little bit of it. <laughs> not a lot. Uh, not a lot. You might think a lot is appropriate, but it's not a little bit <laughs> of insurance. <laughs> <laughs> This is the greatest integrated Geico added <laughs> podcast history. <laughs> I'm just saying you're asleep at home. <laughs> knock, knock, knock. Uh -huh. Who's there? Uh, I, I'm asleep. <laughs> I don't know. <laughs> Florida. What? <laughs> the I'm entire offering, state? I'm offering Florida insurance. So, in the, so Florida doesn't show up to my house? In the event you get annexed by Florida, yeah. we will pay out money. The insurance will pay out money if Florida comes to Austin and annexes it. Uh, well, I mean, I, I don't know where you're going to be. Oh, okay, I mean, you yeah. might you I might be, be anywhere. In New England, yep. Old England, yep. Middle England, <laughs> yeah. Far England, mm -hmm. Northern England. Yeah. Hooray. <laughs> England, England. Look, are you going to buy or not? Englanders? I've got 12 more calls to make. No. <laughs> oh. Welcome to the show, ladies and gentlemen. Yeah, um, Brian. Oh, I, I really liked the wilting applause. <laughs> the, the, yeah, that was the... Oh, no, no oh. it was a bad bit. <laughs> oh, it was a bad bit. Oh. oh Should have taken out insurance uh, on that. I, <laughs> if we could take out insurance on bad bits, we'd, we'd effectively be barred from taking out insurance. That would be insider trading. Yeah, we would we would take out insurance on bad bits like a, 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 a mob owned pizza restaurant. <laughs> take out insurance. We would be the the the, the snake of Wall Street uh, because we would be fraudulent. Hey, Bryce. Uh, <laughs> Snakes. Oh, thanks. <laughs> okay. Uh, Josie, my daughter, 14 years old. Uh, uh, yes. uh playing the bass. She's slapping the bass. Slapping She's, yeah, uh, she is. Uh, 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 wants to get a snake. Oh wow! So she's fully that girl. You. Yeah. Like she's in, she's in a full that girl phase. Well, I mean, I, here's the problem. Yeah. Is she's been an exceptional pet keeper of our three albino snails that have multiplied as an invasive species and have become 40 of them and who continue to grow because Bonnie will <laughs> not do what the state of Texas recommends <laughs> Which and flush them, kill them. Yeah. Uh, and, and I keep asking Josie, I was like, well, what about the, the snails? And, and Josie unrepentant is just like, yeah, I don't understand why we don't just murder them all. I, I, it's <laughs> the only responsible thing to do. Bonnie, not a fan, right? Gotcha. Meanwhile, she's got lizards that she takes care of, a, 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 a fish, you name it, right? <clears throat> she really wants a snake. Okay. I'm not in the room. I hear the presentation. She has made a Google document presentation. Pause, pause real quick. Yep, yep, yep. Do you know that's like a thing with the youth? Oh, yeah. 
Uh, Slideshows? I, I, I mean, I know that's, that that's what they learn in school and yeah. have to do for school. Yeah. So no, apparently, that is a thing with 20-somethings is to have uh, slideshow parties. Oh, that actually sounds awesome. Where everybody... I didn't say PowerPoint. Uh, Prezi! <laughs> Prezi, fuck you! <laughs> Uh, uh, Nobody knows what Prezi is. It's fine. No, all the Prezi heads, please go wild in the chat. Uh, uh, everybody, if you love Prezi, please uh, uh, tweet at Schwood. Okay. Uh, I'm I'm about to delete a certain Prezi presentation <laughs> I've been working on. <laughs> I need you to stop saying this. Uh, uh, so yeah, so that that is a thing that that twenty somethings will have parties in which everybody is required to give a funny or humorous like presentation via slides relevant to the story. How do you think Bonnie feels about snakes? Poorly. Yes. Yeah. Uh, if you were to say firmly whether she would be open to having a snake in the house or not. Uh, I think she would uh, uh, say, fuck that. Yep. Never. Yep. Never, ever. Yep. Uh, uh, I, I regret giving birth to you right. if it means that you brought a snake into my house. Okay, now imagine you heard all of that. You're yeah. 14 and you're my daughter. Yeah. So it's probably not unusual for her to respond with, uh, I hear what you're saying. <laughs> <laughs> Holy shit! <laughs> she, hey boss, mom! <laughs> I have a very short she presentation. Has, she has the gift. <laughs> I would like to give you. I'm in the other room. I'm not a part of any of this. Yeah. Uh, we're watching some show, and, and she's like, Mom, I got to do my presentation. So I don't see any of the visuals. I'm certain they are rich and detailed and all that stuff. And she goes, snakes. <laughs> so here. Now, I know what you're thinking. Ooh, gross. But did you know that snakes are cuddly and awesome? Here is a snake with a hat. Here's another. <laughs> Here's another snake with that. I don't see any of this. I yeah. only hear it. And then she and then she talks about like, uh, now I know what you're thinking. Snakes. Big old fat smelly dumps. I will <laughs> smell them in my sleep and I'll get up and clean them up. You know I'm good because of my track record. Points to track record is this, of being <laughs> By the way, is is this an I think you should leave sketch? <laughs> Big old smelly dumps. <laughs> She said, uh, you're worried about escapes. <laughs> Don't worry. This cage is super great. Like, I listened for like seven full minutes as, <laughs> as she gives <laughs> this snakes with hats, snakes are cute presentation. And I, I hear Bonnie say, um, uh, well, that is, a, that is a fine presentation, yeah. and I will take it under advisement. Uh, I'll get back to you in a week. Tenacious. Yeah, like 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 selling Florida insurance. Yep. This one, like hey, like hey, she. Hey, what do I need to tell you <laughs> right, right now to get, right to get you into a snake? <laughs> metaphorically, it eventually becomes a moment that I'm like, I have to leave because, as we talked about in the green room, <laughs> I have to protest my property values. Yeah. Yep. So. I am not to be disturbed. I get disturbed with a phone call of a, a speakerphone argument of like, snakes, no snakes, snakes, no snakes. And I'm, I, and, and I'm like, okay, boop, boop, boop. And uh, eventually <laughs> you, you hit the abdicating <laughs> parent button. <laughs> That's correct. That's boop, correct. Boop, boop. Uh, uh, to be honest, uh, yeah, I'm not going to show it. Uh, but uh, but um, uh, so uh, Josie has a concert because... Um, uh, by the way, uh, that movie, School of Rock with Jack Black or yep, whatever, yep, yep, yep. Uh, based in part on Band-Aid uh, School of Music right here in Austin, which is, Texas. Yeah, in South Austin, right? Uh, uh, yes, correct. Yeah. As a matter of fact, uh, they perform I, 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 at I local walk, venues. I walk by it uh, uh, on, my, on my walk down Oh, that's Lamar. right. Yeah. So uh, past or, 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 walk, studio. Uh, the, 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 the signs, I, I've actually driven by it, but yeah. Yeah, yeah. But uh, uh, so at any rate, uh, she has a concert. Uh, uh, we do the thing. And Bonnie is like, I've had it up to here with the snakes. I don't know how to explain it. Like, there will never be a snake in my house. I can't handle it. Uh, I grew up in the country. I hate snakes. I hate yeah. snakes. And I'm like, I'm like, uh, cool. We'll let her down easy. She is not letting it go. She finishes rocking on the bass, and then we're like, anyway, snakes. <laughs> and it's <laughs> well, just like, like, girl, would you calm down? Your mom yeah. can't handle this shit. We get home. Uh, uh, <laughs> get home. And, and uh, we're tootling around, just calming down. I'm about to go back to protesting taxes. Yeah. And then I hear, ah, from the master bedroom. And I go into the master bedroom. There's nobody there. I go into the master bathroom. And there is Bonnie fully curled up into a ball and just saying, 
why is there a snake in my bathroom? And I was like, what? And she goes, that. And I was like, that's a worm. And she goes, no, it isn't. And I lean in, and sure enough, that motherfucker is a fucking baby snake. A baby <laughs> snake. <laughs> baby so, snake. Here is the thing I have never seen before. Yeah. Bonnie, look at me with the accusing eyes and broken trust. <laughs> oh, <laughs> of like, no. did you, you buy do a baby this? Snake? Uh, so anyway, a snake showed up. It broke my marriage, and uh, Josie, I was like, Josie, this is the closest you're going to get to getting a snake. And she was like, oh, I don't know how to take care of these. I'm just going to throw it away. <laughs> and she oh, did. What oh, the yeah. fuck? <laughs> she threw it. I mean, she threw it over the fence. It's fine. It's happy. It, yeah, it went to a farm. Yeah, yeah, yeah. That's oh, where oh, it oh. lives forever. That's Snake Valhalla over the fence. <laughs> oh, yeah. Fence. I'm like 90% sure Bonnie does not think that I worked out a deal with Josie. So you you believe that she thinks there was some there was some shenanigans going well, on. The, there the, was some snake planning. The first time that I thought that maybe she didn't trust me yeah. was when she said the words, I don't trust you. <laughs> I think you and Josie <laughs> have cooked this up. Yeah. <laughs> and uh, I had so, to. So does she think that this was a plan that went awry that you had kept a, a a small snake somewhere in the house and it got loose or that this was the way that you were hoping that she was going to roll into the bathroom and be like oh what an adorable snake i think she eventually realized that like for the exact reason that she didn't want a snake which yeah. is snakes be sneaking in yeah Sorry, snakes be sneaking in. Yeah. <laughs> uh, but uh, I, 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 she eventually believed me. But, but yeah, but but there's no forgetting that yeah. look of of betrayed. And trust. also, she wasn't here this week, so uh, that, yes, uh, that is yeah. that is also telling. Bryce, next topic. Uh, next topic. <laughs> Justin Chains. No, in chains, like a band. Our next topic, shit, 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 I've got, shit, these snakes. I've got like an auto sleep thing on my phone. The screen keeps turning off. An um, auto sleep thing. <laughs> sleep. Brian, I shaved my head. Uh, I was, I, I'm aware. Hey, by the way, how did everybody at home like all the uh, produced videos that, that Bryce did? Hopefully they Vegas went and watched event. it. Yeah, go on the event. YouTube. Yeah. Uh, I don't actually, I think it came out in between our, our two shows. So go check out our YouTube channel. Uh, oh, no, no, I think it was yeah, yeah, no, yeah. before. We, we before did a show the week, week. Uh, right after, and yeah. then and then the week after. That's why it feels like it's been forever. Yeah, go go check it out. Uh, uh, Bryce did an amazing job on on everything. We have the the, the two personal uh, mentalist acts. We have the whole video of uh, me getting shaved bald. Uh, Brett's one hundred dollar bet, which yeah. uh, is you can tell by the runtime how Great fast job, it goes. <laughs> <laughs> uh, Three uh, minutes. Yeah, people in the chat seem like they really really dug it. Oh, good. Yeah. But, uh, so I have this shaved head now. Yeah. And it's growing in some hair. But I'm, I'm realizing that, especially for the summer, because it's been hot here in Austin. Yeah. I might be entering into my full Florida man arc. Which means you're afraid of Florida and you want to buy insurance. <laughs> <laughs> so when you're in your full Florida man arc, there are yeah. a few archetypes. Like flip-flops, obviously. Shorts. Uh, uh, tank tops. Okay. Maybe tattoos. Mm. Maybe a button down. Uh, a lot of, sure. a lot of, a lot of, uh, uh, the word. Shut up. <laughs> yeah. Brian is wearing flip flops right now. <laughs> yeah. Uh, a, a lot of the word bro. Uh, but one thing that I was like, yeah, you want to know what? I, I think maybe. Okay. Now, I, I, I've heard this. Yeah. But I have not been able to tell whether or not you're serious about it. What have you heard? You saying, yeah, I've got the Florida man look. Yeah. I Should think... I steer all the way into it? And, and I was like, what does that mean? And, and you said, just, just a little gold necklace. Little a chain. Chains. A chain. Chain. Yeah. yeah, yeah a yeah. gold chain. I mean. I think I might be moving into a gold chain phase. Ladies and gentlemen. Fact, I, 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 I think that I might be moving into a multiple gold chain Oh, phase. no. Yeah. Ladies and Maybe. gentlemen, take your look for only one dollar. Take your very last look <laughs> at Justin Robert Young's last time ever appearing anywhere without 
Gold Chick! <laughs> God damn it. <laughs> What's up, bro? Should have bought that insurance. <laughs> All right, what do you think? What do you think? Gold chain? We got Jen Briney. <laughs> That's a hard no. A hard no hard on the gold no. chain. I have gold chain and sunglasses. I think I look fucking, <laughs> fucking awesome. <laughs> I think I look really good. Uh, so, uh, give me a close up on Justin. And I want, like. <laughs> <laughs> Come on! <laughs> This guy this either guy. deals coke or is a record producer who knows Pharrell. Oh, all so of both. these. Both I want all both. of these quotes next to that photo <laughs> <laughs> for like motivational posters. <laughs> I think I look great. What I like <laughs> what I like is that your sunglasses are a little dirty. <laughs> <laughs> that again, they, they, that's, that's, that's part, part of it. That's, that's part, part, of it. part of it. <sighs> Completely. Uh, uh, I don't know. Gold chain. What do you think? What do you think? Gold chain. Uh, you know what? Let's... I don't care about the haters, bro. I don't care about the haters. <laughs> like I care. I care about my boys. My boys, man. What's up? Uh, I know you are a man of science. Yeah. So let's <laughs> do an experiment. Yeah. Wear those sunglasses for the next twenty minutes. <laughs> Sure. Wait, I'm allowed? Yep. Next segment. Okay. Uh, our next segment. Uh, is... Also, talk about politics. <laughs> <laughs> Starstruck at Wizard Academy. That sounds like a good story, bro. <laughs> <laughs> you know what? I, Actually, for this story, I, I, I mean, I have to request that you take the sunglasses. You know what? It's, <laughs> it's, it's too late. It's too late. Uh, uh, Brett, what happened at Wizard Academy? Yeah, what's up? So uh, every Friday or <laughs> every other Friday, yeah, uh, Brian and or I uh -huh. will arrive at the Wizard Academy to visit uh, with the peers. Crowded Barrel Distillery mm -hmm. or the Fang and Feather. Heaven forbid you should have one fucking name for the distillery that we go to every yeah, Friday. Too complicated. Yeah. Yep. And uh, that's where, and that's where uh, 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 the boy Heaton goes. Yes, Heaton was there. As a matter of fact, facts. So <laughs> I show up <coughs> a little late in the process. Yeah. Uh, but uh, go and say hello to everybody. Sit down. And uh, as I'm talking with my friends, who's the worthless bastards, uh, uh, two, three. That's young like your men. crew. Yeah, that's my crew. <laughs> facts. That's my crew. So uh, three uh, young just, men. Justin, I love you. Yeah. Uh, as 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 a comedy partner, I want to express my concerns about. What's up, dude? <laughs> What's up? I've, I've always Yo, for real, man. That's family, bro. Bro, bro, that's family, though. Yo, bring it bro, in for family. Bro, bro, that's family. Bring it in for yeah, family, family, though. Yeah. Yo, that's family. Boom. Fucking bro, that's family. That's family, bro. For real. You know that, right? You know that shit, right? You know that, right? That's my dog, dude. That's my fucking dog right there. <laughs> Look, I What's up, dude? I support you. Fucking speak your mind, my guy. Speak your mind. <laughs> I support your right. Bro, go. I support <laughs> your right. For real. <laughs> I need to hear what you have on your heart, my guy. <laughs> Bro, I support your right to be your best you. Facts. <laughs> <laughs> but as your comedy partner, Bet. I must express uh -huh. that I, 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 I don't know how I feel about who you are when you're this dope. <laughs> <laughs> yes, when, when you're this dope. Yeah, uh, fucking it, facts. <laughs> family, dog. Look at it. Look at it. That's Mortal. family. <sighs> so, so what happened? So there are young men. Three young men uh, wander over to where this, our group was and asked to sit down. And uh, one of them noticed that I had my Rocket City Trash Pandas uh, t-shirt on, which is an official uh, Major League Baseball merch. For real. The guy, <laughs> and my guy says to me, oh, my God, you know Huntsville's. Uh, Alabama's. Uh, yes. Yeah. And I was like, yes, I do. And he's like, oh, well, we're 
from Madison. And I was like, wow, that's amazing. My wife's from Madison. And then we go on and just, they're like, we just never, we've seen so many famous people here and, and here in Austin and how it's working. And, and they're saying, in fact, we met uh, Andrew Heaton earlier today. We never thought that would happen. Brian Brushwood, do you know who he is? And I was like, I do a show with him. And they're like, oh, my God. That's, wait, we don't know. Well, anyway, so these other <laughs> famous people who we met, they kept going. Yo, 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 bro, who are these jokers? <laughs> hey, they, they who are these some, jokers that don't know you? They're just some guys. They're, okay, they're, they, they should know you, though. We're in getting the making. there. All right? We're getting there. And so uh, uh, D- my buddy Doug and my friend Monica were there, and they were watching this exchange go on. And uh, and they were talking about all the famous people they knew. And Doug goes, well, it's funny because Brett... And I went, no, hold on, just wait. And he's like, all right. So they keep talking, and we met this person and that person. And uh, yeah, we're in Florence, uh, Florence, Alabama. I go, didn't they have an anime convention there? And he's like, yeah. And Monica goes, well, that's funny you should say that. And I go, no, <laughs> hold on. And they're like, all right. And so the guys were like, yeah, how do you know about that? I'm like, well, we're talking. And we're going through it. And it's like, so you like anime? Yeah. Well, what's your favorite? And they were going through the stuff. And and we kept going for a while. And all the while, I'm just sitting there and letting it, letting it marinate. And uh, finally, it gets to the end. And I was like, hey, uh, do you guys have IMDb on your phone? <laughs> and uh, they're like, yeah. Yo, hit I'm him like, with it. I was like, uh, look for real though. I go look up. Brett I feel Weaver. like it's infectious. I feel like yeah. <laughs> and, you, and I said, my yeah. guy, look up Brett Weaver. Yeah, because this, yeah, you know, this, 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 this would be the first time that I started doing a voice, and yeah. you immediately started doing it. <laughs> yeah, you're good. Hey, you're a good salesman, you know, my guy. We just know what happened. And so the guy looks up on the phone, and he goes. Holy shit! You were on, you're the thing for Smite. You were in this. You were in that. I'm like yes, and and I turned to my friends and I went. That's why you wait right there. You wait because it feels so much better. Uh, yo, we, we, Brett, my dude. So for real, <laughs> this is a real achievement. Everybody <laughs> should time code this on Twitch because you just told the first story where. The good guy in the story told strangers to look them up on IMDb. Oh. <laughs> <laughs> Normally, that's not the don't good you, guy, my guy. I, I, Normally, usually, that's not the good guy. I usually, but I'm you the did it. Goes, don't you, you know who it. I am? You look me it. up on IMDb. You did it, my guy. You did it. <laughs> uh, so uh, before that happened, uh, they uh, they walked over. They were like, "Are right, you Brian Brushwood?" I was like, "Yeah, yeah." yeah. And and. Uh, always at the crowded barrel everybody's there to see rex and daniel and i'm just the loose cannon that shows up on the channel from time to time and so people barely know me and so he's like oh and i was like oh, are you here to see him and i point to rex williams uh our friend who shows up here sometimes mm-hmm. uh and and, and he, he goes no who's that <laughs> and i was like i was like don't worry about it you, you host the channel that up uh, don't worry about it. He's like, hey, can we do a picture? I'm like, yeah, yeah, we'll do a picture, right? And then uh, and I was like, get a picture with Rex because, like, you're going to become a fan soon enough. He's like, okay, he takes a picture with Rex. And then there's this moment he looks at Bonnie and then <laughs> looks forward. And Bonnie was just soaking in the deliciousness of that awkward question of, like, and who are you? Mm-hmm. Because <laughs> because she doesn't know what to do. Yeah. So, so she was like, oh, my God, it was so awkward. I loved every minute of it. Uh, what? Wow, I got to have a thing to say when that happens again. It's like, uh, I, and I told her what you do is when that awkward thing happens where they look at you, just look them in the eye and say, cake farts. That's why you don't recognize this. <laughs> <laughs> cake farts? <laughs> and then that's what they'll say. And then she says, it's a STEM education channel. <laughs> <laughs> no? Go look it up. Go look it up. Is it, look I'm it up. Looking no? at cake look up, farts. Look up her IMDb. Look up cake uh, farts. <laughs> go, go, go ahead. Cake Sorry. farts was in the third season <laughs> of, uh, of, of The Void? <laughs> what? No, uh, you don't show. Show uh, all I know is you'll you get know? exactly what you expect when you look up cake farts. And uh, well, no, I mean, yeah, I know it's a genre of pornography. Is it? Yeah. Mm. I mean, yeah, I have Brazilians in my life. <laughs> like, <laughs> <laughs> all right. Uh, next story, Brian. I was trying to find one that was not horny. <laughs> I couldn't find one. I'm sorry. <laughs> no, it's a bunch, a bunch of big ass Brazilian women farting into cakes. <laughs> 
Man, I'll tell you what, when you actually did <laughs> real media. Oh. <laughs> yes, yeah, there we go. Uh, 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 yeah, when you dig into the crawl spaces of the internet, uh, uh, you find a lot of things that are holding this entire jalopy up. Uh, how many people do you think you could get to say, like, if you legit tried to hype Take a crowd, uh, you might need the glasses for this one. I need uh, hype a crowd, and I want you to say, yeah, for real, what up? <laughs> when I say cakes, you say fart <laughs> cake. Farts. Right. Yeah. Wait, how many people would need to be there for that to happen? Uh, no, no, no. Uh, he wants you to do that. as a percentage? Like, oh. how many people do you think you could get to, to go? In for this that? room right now? Yeah. I wasn't 100. thinking about this room until just now, but now. Yo, yo, yo. <laughs> dale, dale, dale. Here we go. When I say cake, you all say fart. Cake, fart, cake, fart. 100%. 100%. <laughs> Uh, sir, you we did, did not need Florida insurance. Scientifically, we did it. You can't keep getting away with it. <laughs> <laughs> so I go to Philly uh, over the weekend to go cover the primary races that are happening right now, yeah. by the way. Uh, uh, which is also a funny thing is that like, as I'm planning all these trips, I'm like, okay, gotta be there uh, Saturday. They usually have events Sunday. They almost certainly have events Monday. There's like a big blowout kind of thing. And then I have to get back on Tuesday because I have to do this show Correct. and talk in a Florida accent and, talk, <laughs> and, and lead it's a like, cake like, chant. Well, I have to met, I have to meet this person who might become president, this person who might become president, this person who might become president, and then be Florida man. And, 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 and then and be hype up the crowd for cake farts. Professional Florida <laughs> man. So uh, uh, long story short, there is nothing going on in Pennsylvania for this gigantic Senate primary that has had over a hundred million dollars spent on advertising alone. God knows what's uh, been spent on the campaigns, but uh, it's a gigantic big money campaign. Dr. Oz is the leading candidate, although I don't know how the, the, the primary stuff is turning out right now, but he was the polling favorite going into it. He does not have an event the entire weekend. The guy who he's running against has no events the entire weekend. And for context, like, like this is why you have patronage for your political coverage. Because I fly to the places Correct. and I see the people in the moments right before people go vote for them. And then I make my predictions on who's going to win because I'm, I'm judging how nervous the staff is looking and how much the crowd is reacting to them. Like, this is like a whole big thing. Nobody's doing shit except for one candidate. And she has come from behind and is now in, in, in the running. Her name is Kathy Barnett. Uh, she is running with uh, another guy who is now almost certainly going to be the GOP nominee for uh, governor called Doug Mastriano. I, I get to Philly. There's a whole big kerfuffle about me getting a rental car. I finally get in the car and I, I'm going to be effectively like an hour late to this thing that is my only for sure event right. of the entire trip that I have flown across the country to go cover. So like, as that deadline approaches, I have to imagine the anxiety meter is just getting a little bit higher, a little bit higher, a little bit higher, a little bit higher. Like, like I would assume that you don't want to go on your politics coverage podcast and say, <laughs> and, and do the Florida man thing. <laughs> and yeah. say, Yo, dog, I went there. I didn't see any politics. I didn't see shit, dude. <laughs> I didn't see shit. <laughs> I fucking flew all the way there, my guy. I didn't see shit. Uh, so, so, so yeah, you're anxious. I'm yeah, and 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 effectively, I would uh, describe my mood of driving from the Philadelphia airport to the Bucks County venue, which is about an hour away, as. A, a dejected baseball player running to first, knowing he's already been thrown out. Got like, it. I, I am just making my way there because it's good hygiene. And I'm like, well, fuck. I mean, like, I I'll bet you at the very least, maybe I can go. This is supposed to be the last event of the entire campaign for both campaigns. I'm like, right. there can't be that many bars around the venue. I'm sure if I just hang out at one of the two bars Eventually, I'll just see campaign people are, there. Are, are, are you doing like old school, mid twentieth century gumshoe journalism? I, I need fucking content. <laughs> I flew across the goddamn country, and I'm just trying to manufacture how I can have any content. And also, this is the other key to this story: is that before I leave, I'm watching on Twitter. 
the Mastriano campaign is barring all media from getting in and to announcing the this. Uh, they're literally announcing it. If you can see uh, on on the screen right there, a man dressed as uh, the town crier <laughs> who has a gigantic bell see, is stopping all the media from getting in, and they're not even saying who they're with. I'm glad you brought this up because we also offer Massachusetts insurance. <laughs> <laughs> so. Uh, I'm driving and I'm like, ah, oh, fuck. Like, I, I missed everything. A, I missed being there for the event and, and seeing if I could get in. I missed the gigantic shit show where the town crier is yelling at the people from CBS and Fox. That hear ye, hear in. ye, broadcast television is dead. He fucking wasn't even doing a bit, by the way. He was just a <laughs> fucking very serious man in a very silly high socks costume with a tricorner <laughs> hat saying, behind the cones, behind the cones, behind the cones. Uh, Look at me. Do I look serious to yeah, you? Yeah, exactly. <laughs> I'm very serious, man. Please, please step back. So uh, I, I get there. I grab all my equipment, and uh, I walk up. The tri-corner hat guy isn't there, but uh, another dude is. And uh, I just walk up, and I'm like, hey, the event's still going on? And the guys there at the front are like, yeah, who are you with? <laughs> And I'm like, uh, I do an independent podcast. My name is Justin Robert Young, and I do a podcast called Politics, Politics, Politics. I flew up here from Texas literally to go to this event right now. So you just admitted to being a journalist who covers politics on the Internet. I, I said exactly my truth. Yes. <laughs> I spoke exactly what I am and what I do. In your heart of hearts, what are you expecting the response to be at this moment? Uh, them to say uh, no press. Sorry. Okay, that's that's what but I. You had to at least try. I I mean, yeah. Again, I'm I'm running out the thing, so it's like uh uh, uh I just got to get there, and I have to get rejected so I can say on the podcast I went to the thing, I got rejected. The dude who, your guy, he he he, he seems a little receptive to the idea. Goes uh, so uh uh, you're not with anybody. I'm like, no, I'm totally independent. I get funded by people on the internet. He's like, huh. <laughs> Podcast. I'm like, yeah. <laughs> He's like, huh. <laughs> yeah. Hold on, hold on, hold on. Uh, uh, Podcast. Uh, uh, I'm going to ask. And he starts, he starts uh, typing away on his phone. And he's like looking up at me and he's like, you know, because uh, we're not letting in any media. He's like typing on his phone and he looks back up and says a phrase that I will never forget in my entire life, which is, but you might be okay <laughs> because, you know, podcasts aren't real media. <laughs> <laughs> and at that moment, I'm just like, that might be like. The most insulting, but the most professionally rewarding sentence that anyone has ever said to me, yep. because I, because a bunch of the media is still sitting in this tent behind me, and they're not fucking like, doing shit. They're just sitting there, sad in the rain. All right, take your vic victory lap. What are some of the media outlets that you left over? The biggest one was Robert Costa of CBS, not regional CBS, national CBS, producing. For CBS News, running on the national news, running on. Uh, I, all I their wish Sunday you were shows. wearing a chain as you put on the glasses <laughs> and said, "See you later, my guy." Yeah, yeah. Hey, bro. bro. Hey, adios, dude. <laughs> uh, so uh, uh, he gets the text back and he's like, "Yeah, you're good. Go ahead on in." And I'm like, "Cool." <laughs> and, and, and you were even setting up your microphones and everything, and then and then had. Well, no. So so this was so I get in. I, uh, uh, this is like the, the, the big venue and Doug Mastriano, who is going to be the GOP nominee is already talking. And so I'm setting up my mic so I can record him. And as I'm like plugging everything in, uh, two security guards who are also all over the videos of kicking people out initially. Weirdly, they're dressed like red coats. Yeah. <laughs> So they roll up. Hear ye, hear ye. <laughs> the king of Massachusetts did declare that this property shall be media free. <laughs> so they roll up on me and they're like, like, hey man, what are you doing? What are you doing? What are you doing? And I'm like, hey, hey, somebody texted somebody with the campaign. They said I, I'm allowed to be in here and I'm allowed to record. And somebody comes up from the campaign and they're like, you're okay, Justin. 
And the two by name. Yeah, because apparently uh, it, it turns out it's very easy to remember your entire media list when it's one person. <laughs> <on>. <laughs> so you got to exclusively cover the big event. So that was and uh, covered in media. I, uh, uh, that was, uh, yeah, I was the only person that was, that was there. Everybody else was, uh, 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 excluded. Hills. I was the only yeah. person allowed. When in. I say cake, y'all say farts. Cake, farts, cake, farts. All right. Uh, and, 100%. And, and so yeah, the only, the only, the only addendum to that story is, I, uh, I'm on my way out, and I see Tri Corner Hat Guy. Oh. And I walk up to Tri Corner Hat Guy, and I'm like, uh, Hey, you know you're uh, you're famous on Twitter. And he goes. Oh, really? <laughs> <laughs> like, yeah, because you were kicking the media out. And he's like, yeah. <laughs> there we go. That's Try amazing. Guy. Uh, uh, so there we go. Adventures in Pennsylvania. Yay! Uh, Bryce, what do we got? Uh, I think that's it. Is that it? What we got oh, is a fantastic got. Patreon. That's right. Over at uh, Patreon. You know, I've been hearing about this. Where is this Patreon? Patreon.com slash great night. Go there. You get bonus episodes each and every week. But you want to know what? We're cutting that short. What? Because we got something more important to talk about. Wait, we're making the episode shorter? At least tell me there's five of them per week. No, no, no. no. Of course. There's <laughs> up to five. Up to five, up to five up per two, week. Five. Per month. Okay. Per, per month. month. Not per week. Per, per month. month. Yep. Yeah. Yeah. Okay. Yeah. Uh, but no, we are talking about the return. The return. Clack, 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 clack. Of Marvel! Hey! That's right! That's right, folks. Uh, on Friday, uh, we're going to start season three of Marbles. Uh, Describe for maybe. people who ain't never heard of Marbles what the fuck Marbles is, Bryce. Oh, sure. So, uh, uh, you remember when COVID, st COVID started and ESPN was like, Oh, we don't have do I remember? I remember right where I was. I have the warmest feelings of when COVID struck. I thought initially that was going to be a Jimmy Buffett song. <laughs> <laughs> Believe what I remember when COVID started and the lockdown happened and everybody had to take a test. And there was a cruise ship in Oakland. Everybody thought that COVID lasted 10 days on a sink that you would touch and you had to wash your hands for 20 seconds. <laughs> COVID in paradise. <laughs> so I had it once, I don't want it twice. COVID in paradise. <laughs> Everybody thought that Cuomo was a good governor. <laughs> they didn't think that he was killing old folks. And then he touched a city and got fired. Oh. <laughs> So yeah, that's pretty much what Marvel is. <laughs> COVID <laughs> no, in paradise. <laughs> Sorry, Marvel. So, <laughs> Listen to Fauci. Oh, that'll be nice. I like this song. <laughs> Wear a mask. Anyway, so Marvel. So Marvel's. Uh, we literally told Bryce that we would give him the entire <laughs> fucking. We, we were so we magnanimous. Fucking In the pre-production meeting, we're like, we're gonna be so just good. Fucking, we'll just lay out. Giant we'll just runway. Lay out. This we'll is a lay great property. The You're <laughs> great. You're great. Part of the great night Marvel's family. is great. <laughs> <laughs> we, we won't do a parody song. I we wear to God. We, we won't, won't do a parody Jimmy song. Jimmy Buffett's COVID no. Nevada. <laughs> we swear. Oh, no, we'll be right back. Paradise. <laughs> uh, <t> so, <laughs> Mar uh, so uh, marbles racing is the thing. <laughs> uh, uh, <laughs> so when COVID started, what, yeah. rolling down a hill, I'm a marble. You see? No, <laughs> we're not <laughs> doing it. Let them go. So, uh, COVID they, wave three. They made like <laughs> these race tracks where they would let marbles loose and they would go downhill and race each other. So they made a video game out of that. <laughs> And uh, we, uh, we, this is our third season now of, of doing uh, this Marbles race. Uh, everyone in the chat gets a marble with their name on it, and it's free, and uh, we all keep points, and we get to see who's the champion at the end of, uh, of so many weeks. Uh, but I'm really excited. It's been a while since, since we've done it last. It's almost been six months, and I'm very sorry about that, but I'm very excited to come back. Uh, with more marbles. So th this is the thing to do if you are on, uh, if you have free time when? On what, what time does it happen? Fridays. Fridays, 8 to 10 Central Time. 
Uh, so that should be everybody. So uh, Friday nights. Time. Friday, Friday nights. nights is, is is when when you want to carve out time. If you have uh, uh, if you want to just hang out with our rad community and yeah. have a really 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 fun time with Bryce, then uh, you are coming back to this channel. So just that's right. Uh, uh, Twitch.tv slash Night Attack. Night Attack. That's right. And uh, uh, I got an email list if you want info. Marbles.win is the website. Perfect. Uh, more info and schedule stuff soon. So, uh, and I heard, I heard a rumor there might be a, a little uh, uh, a way to support. L- a little little uh, marble uh, yeah. way. <laughs> yeah, a little marble got a baby bump. <laughs> Go, <k-tunk, k-tunk. laughs> Run away from the COVID. <laughs> That's what the little barber in paradise. <laughs> Some people say that the Delta's to blame, but I know do, 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 it that it's Minus' fault. <laughs> <laughs> So marbles dot win is the website. Yes, uh, uh, you'll be able to support marbles uh, very soon. So keep an eye out, but uh, get on the email list. Thank you. I feel like I want to play a game with one of our friends, but I'm not sure if he's one of our friends anymore. <laughs> <laughs> if we've just made this show too toxic, <laughs> yes. Uh, ladies and gentlemen, if he walks up here, please make a warm <laughs> round of applause for Jordan Breeding. <laughs> I think this is a little shorter than. There we go. Yeah. Oh wow. Wait. Wait to point that out immediately. <laughs> yep. That'll make that'll make Brian very happy. Yeah. Way to go. <laughs> I feel like I need to stand back a little bit so we're a little more even height wise. Uh. So uh, uh. For those of you guys who don't. Okay. He's oh, so wow. far back. Two, two <laughs> my guy. Two, the, yeah. The first two lines. Wow. <laughs> Uh, for, for those of you guys who don't know, uh, Jordan Breeding is uh, the face you see on the uh, Crack.com uh, YouTube channel and many other places, right? A few other places. Okay. Uh, 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 Jordan is such a good sport that I was like, yeah, be on our comedy show. And he's like, yeah, cool, whatever. And then uh, I explained to him how it's going to go tonight. And he's like, cool. Uh, and then like uh, five minutes later, I'm like, oh, this is the part where we run off to the bar to do one drink really quick. He's like, he's like, I don't know what's happening at all. Yeah, I I'm still like, have no idea so now, what the show is. So now it should be clear. Yeah, yeah. <laughs> it should be very clear. Yeah, and you have to put on the sunglasses and a gold chain and, and a gold say, "My chain. guy." And yeah, all yeah. yeah. That. You're like, yeah. Uh, we're gonna have a meeting for the show to explain how the show works, and then you're like, snakes, uh, <laughs> Florida, and also we're going to a bar right now. I was like, I don't. Normally, and there's a little more back and forth, but we've kind of got a rhythm going. So just <laughs> oh, you snakes, do, yeah, snakes. yeah. Well, no, sometimes, sometimes, it, like it just goes fast. Sometimes the the, the pre show meeting is just like uh, snakes, bar, <laughs> Florida, wizard, corner hat, wizards, <laughs> chain. We're good. Marbles, we're good? and we're good? we swear we won't do Jimmy <laughs> Buffett. We swear we won't do Buffett. We won't Buffett you, bro. And it was all a lie. Uh, and it was. The good news is we are now to the part where the timeline makes sense, where we are going to play a very simple, sensible game called what, Bryce? It's called Would You Rather Bot Battle. Hey! Would you rather bot battle everybody? <laughs> I didn't hear the battle part. Everything oh. is being added as we go. Yeah, this is great. Uh, so there's one of our favorite Twitter accounts is uh, Would You Rather Bot W Y R underscore Bot. And uh, what they do is every so Don't often. kill him, Elon! <laughs> <laughs> He's not going to buy it. I No, I... <laughs> I, I volunteer his tribute. Yeah. <laughs> Take me. <laughs> He's not going to buy it. So every so often, Would You Rather Bot uh, starts a Twitter poll uh, and gives you two Would You Rather options. I've uh, gone through and picked a few from uh, the past few weeks or so, and uh, you are going to be tasked with figuring out which one the internet picked. So you're not so these are these preference. are Twitter polls that that uh, have already existed for long enough. So we do have final results on all of them, right? And and uh, the the bot is big enough that uh, like like there's a statistically significant like number of people voting. Uh, yeah, it's usually a few hundred people, which is uh, enough to give a good range. Yeah, it's representative of probably. <laughs> The yeah, world? It's probably. Yeah. I don't like how tall you are. <laughs> <laughs> well, that's what I'm looking at this. And it's I'm really like, making me uncomfortable. All right, question <laughs> one. Just like I don't like how stands. wide you I are. <laughs> I got to get ready for the for the bot battle of the friggin. That's what here we go. Let's let's, let's adopt yeah. our bot poses. <laughs> no, now you're even shorter. You yeah, need to, yeah, no, Brian, you don't need to crouch down any further. You're not gonna be laying down on the ground. <laughs> all right, so I'm gonna give you all uh, the same. Would you rather prompt, and you're gonna tell me if it's option one. Or option. By the way, hot. Yeah, twenty five. A hundred people is half of Twitter. <laughs> <laughs> it will be when Elon buys it. 
That's right. <clears throat> All right, we're going to start with Justin on this one. Uh, everybody will answer every round, but we'll start with Justin's guest. Uh, would you rather console gaming or PC gaming? Oh, this shit is written by a person. Ah. There's no way an AI would come up with this. It's not an AI, but people, I, I do think people submit Op, the submit options Teach somewhere. Teach the controversy, Justin. Yeah, all right. So, uh, uh, console, console gaming, gaming or, or PC gaming? PC. On Twitter, ah, fuck. I don't know. Probably fucking a bunch of Xbox, PlayStation people. <laughs> probably. Oh, really? I 100% I think it's PC. Yeah. No, no, but oh. Twitter's, those more, are the angry Twitter's more people. normy, though. <laughs> I, maybe, but I feel like console people... I'm I mean, they're like, all I'm broken. Here they're broken emotionally, but they're mostly like I mean, fucking people who talk about the office. Like, well, that's what I'd say. I, I don't know that they're like they're like console gaming, but it's not even worth fighting. They, PC they, people are like, I have to win this as I win all true. arguments. Every every single PC person is hitting the button. Where most console people are like, what's a console? I like Xbox. <laughs> yeah. They're actively playing their I'm, Xbox. I'm, I'm, while I'm PC still people going are. console though. Uh, I'm gonna go console as well because everybody's responding on a mobile device. Nobody ain't nobody doing nothing on PCs anymore well, except working. Fair. And if you're at work, you shouldn't be on Twitter. Wow. Yeah. You hear that? Mm -hmm. <laughs> oh, wow. Did you hear Where that? You? <laughs> Re Regional manager Brian Brushwood. <laughs> I do have a collared shirt, sir. That's true. Right. It's gonna be revealed <laughs> in season season two of Severance. Oh, have you noticed wow. though? Uh, I don't know if you've noticed this. The movies, the short. Collared shirt yeah. is always the the sub. That's the that's the grunt level. I'm employee. comfortable with this. Okay, <laughs> just say <laughs> the bosses all have full sleeves. I, I'm aware. Yeah, yeah. Okay. By the way, he said yes when you just said sub. <laughs> yeah, I was like, yeah, that's me. <laughs> yeah. Uh, also in the office. Yeah. Uh, so, right. so 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 your your console your PC. Hundred percent. Right, yeah. Console. Brian, you're gonna say console. All right. The answer we were looking for was. <gasps> We were looking for PC games. Yeah! Yeah! Wow! What is the uh, what is the discrepancy? Like, what is the actual percentages? Oh, Do you have it? Great question. Uh, and you know, oh. I'm gonna go over to <laughs> Would You Rather <laughs> underscore. A, I'm gonna go to little aggro. Oh, it's, uh, he's it's just tall, winner he's takes tall, all. He got, he got one. He got one answer right. He's yeah. bargain he's, orders the price. He's tall. <laughs> he's right, and he's asking the important questions. How vote Jordan Breeding today? <laughs> How right am I? Sixty-four percent, almost double. Almost wow. double the. Uh, yeah, you were right. You were yeah. right. Yeah. Strong. Wow. All right. Well, I, I one can... answer correct. He's gonna he's gonna uh, uh, prop Bryce to do a marbles plug and then do an Eddie <laughs> Money parody. <laughs> <laughs> All right, that's one point to Jordan. Let's go to the next one here. Uh, and Jordan, you're gonna answer first. Okay. Would you rather have your own gold <laughs> toilet or have your own wheel? <laughs> <laughs> My own wheel for what? Oh, I think uh, I, no, I think I gave you the just question. This, this, this is the bot. This is the question. This is the bot. It's gotta yeah. be. It's gotta be gold toilet. I could smelt that into something usable. What am I gonna do with a freaking wee one wheel? Yeah. Hey, what are you gonna do? Uh, yeah. Sell thanks, it? thanks, Trump. <laughs> <laughs> I mean, plus also he who smelt it dealt it. So that's mm -hmm. undeniable. I'm, try, I'm yeah. trying for an, M uh, an MSNBC gig. <laughs> <laughs> In this exact moment, I can use a wheel because I have a flat. Tire on my car. Uh -oh. Is that a wheel? That's a tire. Do that's you think that the that's a different circle? The voting population of Twitter was taking that into account. Uh, what? What, if, what if it was your own wheel of time? <laughs> wheel. <laughs> it's a, a you get that a, shit a adapted, adapted that by would Amazon. Show up on Amazon. Yeah. 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 Uh, <laughs> that would be worth a certain amount of money. exactly. Unclear. You'd be fucking. Robert Jordaning it. We, uh, well, eventually. All right, Brian. Gold toilet or wheel? Uh, 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 mm. Here's Dude, my you question. You were literally just going to hit me with eventually Brandon Sanders. Yeah. Yes, I was, but I got cut <laughs> off just in time. You're welcome. Thank you, Bryce, my attorney. <laughs> I'm looking out for you. <laughs> uh, here's what I strongly suspect, is that the gold toilet is fairly synonymous with Trump, which makes me suspect that people would not select it except for Trump people. And I think there's a lot of Trump people. I'm going to say gold toilet. <laughs> you think would you rather <laughs> bot is full mega hive? No, I think that the people voting are full mega hive. Yeah. All right. Justin, what's this run on truth social? Uh, was this run on, was this run on? <laughs> yeah. Fucking, uh, uh, this is on eight, vote. Eight 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 votes. Yeah. <laughs> Uh, what about uh, what about Elvis? Didn't he die in a golden? Toilet? I think he died in a golden toilet. I, uh, no, 50, 50 a toilet. He died Elvis on a rock. regular American toilet. Yeah. Uh, no, <laughs> no he had a in Graceland. In Graceland. Yeah. But where did the gold come if, from? If you say so, that's true. But Unethical. He, no, he did die in Graceland. Right? <laughs> 
<laughs> yes, he did. Jesse, did we're he looking die? <laughs> yeah, he I, may have died nowhere. I, I, I don't think that this is a would you mega bot. So uh, I, I, I do think that it is or have your own wheel. Now, if it was a silver toilet, it would be antimicrobial. And maybe turn you blue. No, I that although was you'd be in prison. Uh, wait, what? Oh, wait, uh, that's stainless steel. Uh, yeah, they don't have silver toilets in prison. Well, <laughs> no, but yeah, but it looks silver. And silver's, they do look silver. Yeah, silver's silver not anti color. antibiotic, though. Copper. Yeah, it is. Is it? I thought I mean, copper I mean, that, was. That's why people snort it and turn blue. You've seen that picture of that weird dude that looks like Papa Smurf, right? And well, that's our suggestion. He was snorting What the fuck toilet? is happening Wait, right now? Wait, you guys don't know about this? Okay, there's a subsection of the human population. Brett, tell me you understand. I know exactly what you're talking about. Uh, okay. uh, Lloyd <laughs> he, Silver. He said waking up. Yeah, sorry. <laughs> <laughs> the uh, uh, so, so uh, 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 silver is antimicrobial. That's why like space stuff is coated in silver or whatever. Uh, 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 people will snort silver. That's why. Uh, uh, but anyway, if you ingest enough silver, your whole skin turns blue, yep. like you're a goddamn Smurf. And there's a photo to prove it. My attorney Bryce Castillo I'm for it. I'm turning is blue. About to reveal something that will blow your mind. Yo, yo, something yo. that you yeah, ain't bro, ever bro, seen. Bro, 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 for real. Yes. Yo. Yes. You holding? Because <laughs> <laughs> oh if not, because if go. not, because if not, there my boy Mondo, my boy Mondo, there he's got that is. silver. He's got that silver. Wait, did I miss it? We've we've got it here. That dude. Oh my god. Is goodness. there any other reason to do it besides this exact <laughs> Turning blue. Is there a reason it makes for like also, trivia for people? It is, it is Why alleged. did Tim Allen let Richard Karn do this? <laughs> <laughs> and this is on the Today Show set. This is not a like an old well, photo. Also, yeah. which writer in the Santa Claus is this? <laughs> no contract humor. <laughs> not e not even my attorney laughed. All right, it's fine. Cuck, Santa Claus. <laughs> nope. Don't <laughs> leave it go. Leave it go. All right. Next all right. round. Oh, Where we, are no, we? We, yeah. oh, we, so we've got our answers oh. here. So the yes. uh, recapping, the options were, <laughs> would you rather gold toilet? Gold toilet. Have a gold toilet or your own wheel. Also, Bryce's only instruction to us on this game is, can you guys take it seriously? <laughs> <laughs> That was his only thing. He's like, by the way, we usually fuck around too much. We no. need to take it seriously. This is no, we we're actually doing very, very well. Uh, <laughs> all right, so everybody's answers. Justin said wheel. Jordan and Brian said gold. We were looking for bum bum bum. Have your own wheel. <laughs> what? Yeah. That's a Justin point. <laughs> That's a just cool. I mean, I wish you could explain why. Like, to the what end? What? Have, uh, uh, what was the ratio? This. What was the ratio? Uh, 53.5% uh. said wheel. It was very close, actually. Ah, Bush Gore again. <laughs> <laughs> Round yeah. two. I could do political. Bro, bro, bro. I was counting chads, bro. <laughs> How many chads you need, bro? <laughs> Brett, what is our score here? Uh, if, I'm, if I'm counting this correctly... Yes, okay. Mm -hmm. It's uh, Brian has one point. Uh, no. Jordan. Jordan's got one. Has <laughs> one point. <laughs> no, Justin, is that right? And Justin has no point. Justin just got that point. Yeah, the, <laughs> Justin <laughs> just got this point. <laughs> Are the listeners having trouble keeping along with the, the yeah. two no, points that have been possible? Clear. Everything's very clear. Everything's very uh, listen, clear. Listen, we've been playing game Wait, time. how many points? <laughs> He's got... One? One point. <laughs> okay. You, you know what? Got, let's, just, let's just back up. <laughs> one this point. game is a freaking rip it. <laughs> like, of all the people to be having that much trouble with two points. <laughs> and also, Sorry, I've been having edibles. <laughs> <I don't know. laughs> and also, never mind. Okay, <laughs> round three. After this round, we should recap because I'm going to forget. <laughs> yeah. All right. We'll just, <laughs> yeah. I mean, there's a lot of conversation <laughs> going on. I'm just right? going to yeah. hold this up so I don't forget. <laughs> COVID <laughs> in paradise. <laughs> Paradise spike protein on a sneeze would be nice. <laughs> <laughs> All right, we've got your next round here. Would you rather, Brian, we'll start with you. Would you rather NASCAR or Goku's Academy? God damn it. God damn Finally, it. the real questions <laughs> that uh. the lamestream media refuses to ask. <laughs> this is straight up a question of uh, what age do you think would you rather bought Viewers are, and I'm gonna say they're. You think, you think young kids? Wait, wait, wait. Which is like NASCAR? 
I'm going to say cars. Do you think that you start with NASCAR and you graduate to Goku or do you start with Goku and you graduate (laughs) to NASCAR? It's a wave. (laughs) You go, (laughs) you you, you, you start off NASCAR because your dad was NASCAR. You get frisky and you go Goku. Yeah. But once you go Goku, you experiment with Goku in college. you, You eventually come home a changed man. The hero's journey. I'm going with NASCAR. <laughs> He's going NASCAR. All right. Uh, I think you literally just talked yourself into realizing that NASCAR is on both ends yep. of the hero's That's journey. That's exactly right, yep. sir. Uh, no, no you find your way back. Goku. I plead the fifth. You can speak to my attorney, <laughs> Bryce Castillo. He's Goku's done. the dark knight of the soul. Yeah. Justin, <clears throat> NASCAR or Goku's Academy. Except when he goes Super Saiyan. Come on. Goku. Uh, mm-hmm. Holy shit. Oh, <laughs> fucking literally... <laughs> Siri just found Goku. Yeah, <laughs> <laughs> yeah it's like you That's need Goku, Goku, baby. <laughs> Shit, I feel like your robot is helping you cheat. Uh, yeah, no, I, 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 I gotta go Goku now. You got? I, I think I think Goku's Academy. Uh, yeah, it's it's the internet. They they don't like uh, jock shit. Mm. All right, uh, Jordan. What do you think? NASCAR so or the way Academy? that the question is phrased is, "Would you rather?" Yeah. And I don't know if this was true of anybody else in high school, but NASCARing was theoretically when uh, you grabbed the guy next to you's junk, he oh, grabbed no. yours, and whoever could get the other to go. This is not something we did. <laughs> <That's>, <laughs> no, go, go on. Go on. <laughs> Goku's Academy is something I'm not aware of. Uh, so, <laughs> so, so that oh, would be oh, novel oh, and new. You, you and your friends didn't Goku's Academy? <laughs> oh my not, god. Not, Fre- uh, with frequency, no. Yeah, well, let, let me just tell you, when you go Super Saiyan, uh, you're going to have to explain the mess to your mom. Wait, <laughs> wait when you go Super <laughs> Saiyan, you're you're not playing. No, no. Yeah, uh, yeah, that's what they used to I, say. I withdraw mm-hmm. my question, Your Honor. <laughs> Strike it from the record. So given, Thank you. Given Thank those. This guy. I'm here for you. <laughs> All right. NASCAR. Yeah, I'm going to say, I don't know. Uh, wait, that was a real thing? No, I don't know. NASCARing? <laughs> no, I don't oh, know. Oh, that was not a real thing. This, no. so, well, this is what we said was a real thing, but this was kind of like... No, but, but this is a thing that friends said to each other. That's what the, the, the three people I knew said to each other. Yeah, the urban <laughs> the urban myth that you guys might have created. Correct, yeah, gotcha. yeah, yeah. Okay. Suburban myth. Uh, you don't know where he grew up. Yeah, he had three he could have been, He could have been deep in the heart of the city. <laughs> I'm selling papes. Do you, can you guess where I grew up? It's uh, where America? now, yeah, America. I live deep in the heart of it, America. <laughs> Just <laughs> mostly in the aorta. Yeah, right. Um, so with all that said, I'm gonna say Goku for no, <laughs> yeah, um, yep. no real reason. Okay, no, uh, no real reason for Goku. I don't want to ask our currently, so yeah. <clears throat> all right, there we go. Uh, we were looking for. The correct answer was Goku's yeah! Academy. Damn it. That's a point for Jordan. They don't and like Justin. Gotcha, man. How many points do I have? Uh, uh, two points. Two points. Does he? Jordan and Justin both have each two points. What about me? How many do I have? Oh, it's going to take so long to count all of your points. <laughs> uh, 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 goodness. Next question. <laughs> Next question. All right. And Justin, we're going to start with you on this one first. <laughs> Suck it. Yeah. Would you rather Daredevil's Billy Club or Batman's Batarang? Oh, come on. <laughs> I think that's... Would you rather a Netflix series or the biggest franchise in comics? I don't know, though, but the Billy Club is always with you. Batarangs, like, are... are you have are... to go retrieve. Yeah. It's so much work. No, he's probably leaving them, right? <laughs> he's a billionaire. That's true. I guess he he kind of throws it so that you know. Like, a, a he fact, was there. Factor in how little the manufacture of that Batarang cost to him and the fact that he's chasing Harley Quinn. Like, he's not going back to pick well, him up. I mean, isn't he just littering? Isn't he <laughs> just using his... Billionaires are littering. <laughs> yeah, are there? I don't care about the streets when it comes to someone's paid. I thought you I pay your taxes. Sorry, hello, <laughs> it's me, Brian Brushwood. Yeah, yeah, okay, listen. Yeah, I'm Batman. I I was told you're yeah. here to clean up the streets. I'm so I 
As a taxpayer, <laughs> you don't know who I am. Oh, wait, I, but I so, sorry. But you, you can you presume wealthy? that I'm a citizen of. So you make no, it at least no, enough to no, pay taxes. No, I don't have to be wealthy. I could be. I could be a regular person. You I could what? be a garbage man. I, I, you I, don't know that I'm not a garbage okay. man. I pay your taxes. Uh, Pick up the battery. So are you willing to Pick look it me, up? Look me in the eye. Look me in the I'm eye. I'm recording you. I'm holding up I'm a pinky. I'm posting this to Facebook. <laughs> okay. You promised me that by you night. Should be it up. By night you fight crime. Yeah. By day you pick up your own battery no. and clean up. I don't. You won't. You I won't pay my taxes. Promise. You won't pinky promise. I, no. People should look. <laughs> <laughs> Nobody else is chasing Solomon Grundy. <laughs> I Nobody really like that man with a chain. By the way. Clayface. <laughs> Nobody right. else is chasing Bane. Right. I am. Sometimes I drop a few batarangs, <laughs> and I'm getting sick and fucking tired. Excuse me. Sick and tired. I'm sorry. Of, I don't know who's recording. I'm, I'm sorry. I'm sick and tired of people not picking up my batarangs and just throwing them oh, away. So you think other people should pick up your batarangs? I pay your salary. I'm, I'm sorry. I brought my attorney. Uh, uh, he's going to talk to you now. Who, the, who are you? <laughs> It doesn't matter. He's, he's one of the other super villains. Yeah. He's going to get Batman by you're, you're getting the, him with some sort of technicality. I'm thinking, <laughs> you're the I'm newest, think, I'm thinking about it. The newest I'm, super villain of the DC universe. <laughs> that's right. Amber Heard. <laughs> oh. All right. Objection. We've, we're doing a game. Oh, yeah. My attorney. My attorney. <laughs> we're doing okay. a game. I'm, right. I'm here for you. We're All right. doing a game. <laughs> the flag was thrown on the Amber Heard joke. <laughs> Oh, I thought there was something there with Karen Batman. Karen Batman. <laughs> <laughs> oh, I pay oh. my taxes. <laughs> I thought that was a former president of ours. Would you rather... Karen Batman? I mean, when you think of it... Yeah. We're going to have a Karen Batman works. someday, yeah. All right, Justin, we're starting with you. Daredevil's Billy Club or Batman's Batarangs? Oh, fucking Daredevil. <laughs> really? <laughs> Just for the comedy. That's a, that's a cop. <laughs> that's a cop weapon. I'm gonna say batarangs. A cop weapon. Okay, they're I'm, out I'm, there. Well, like a British cop, like a fancy, a fancy cop. Like uh, yeah, like mob. I'll box your ears. Yeah. Yeah. <laughs> like like, like um, a Keystone cop. Yeah, yeah. He's like, come here, Batman. Oh! And he pulls yeah. over. Right, right, right. Yeah, yeah. Uh, I, I'm gonna go batarangs. <laughs> You're yeah. also gonna go batarangs. There we go. Okay. Ah, take the Batman and put him in the in the batty wagon. <laughs> He's got the the batty the batty yeah. wagon. Uh, they the, have the, the, the batty wagon. Batty wagon. Why? Oh, he's, oh. he's on the sauce again, is he? <laughs> <I'm> not <laughs> flying around, <laughs> littering all over the streets, are you? So, all right, okay. okay. They call you the dark knight. I call you a dark blight on this city. Get in the batty wagon. <laughs> <laughs> all right. <laughs> Uh, uh, Brian and Jordan said batter. I think there's too many Irish. <laughs> <laughs> oh, I've heard this one before. I, I think, yep. Yeah. All right. <laughs> We're just save it for the proud gotta boys. Make, gotta, make, gotta make a joke that's too, unfortunately, prescient. Go uh, on. What does it sound like? <laughs> we were no. looking for... <laughs> Batman's yeah! batter! Yes! That's right. That's a point for Brian and Jordan. Okay, it is time for our last round. Brett... What are our scores? <laughs> <laughs> Audio listeners. Yeah, like I can see that. Over here. Over the score. I've oh, yeah. got it written down, oh, I think. Okay. okay. <laughs> just, just, Let's just, play back the tape so we can make sure. <laughs> oh, oh, my God. <laughs> so, Jordan, you're doing great, buddy. <laughs> yeah. You got three points. Oh, hey. God. Yes. That great. That's right. Justin. What up? You're doing all right, my, my guy. My you guy. Got two my points, guy. Right? That's right. Okay. And Brian, you are whoever you are. I'm number you one. Got, you, get, you got one point. That's right. I'm number right, one. Bryce. That's right. That's <laughs> right. Thank you very much, Brett. We number one with the batarang. <laughs> All right. So for a final round here. Yeah, this is battering. really important to me now, now that I'm in the lead. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, the final yeah. round. See, now you understand. Great night. <laughs> <Yeah>. <laughs> now, you, now you've grown. I even warned you. Fullness. What was the one rule I said? The only way to lose the game is to take it seriously. To try to yeah. win the game. Or try yeah, to win the right. game. <laughs> and that's because this is our five point round. Five point. Oh! Five point. It's fine. I've oh, won right. all but one. Uh, right. Don't we, want it too much, Jordan. See, Don't the mere fact that you much. know that tells me that we had a fundamental miscommunication <laughs> earlier. <laughs> Jordan, we're going to start. I am able to count to four with <laughs> surprising accuracy. We're going to start with you, Jordan, since you are in the lead. Would you yes, rather... Sir. 
Oop, that's uh <laughs> give it to a bear uh, okay. or not oh no oh, that's oh, fine no. i got plenty more here would you ah oh, perfect would you rather <laughs> hold on yeah, time out, time out, time out. it doesn't even can, matter can we at least see what the was. question was that the answer was Abs give it to a bear absolutely we can i'm i'm so glad you asked me that question brian would you rather give it to a bear or take it from us oh well that <laughs> I think we would have been unanimous on giving yeah, it to a bear. Yeah. I mean, I guess By the way, I, I love that both of those are James Brown ad-libs. <laughs> <laughs> Give it to a bear! Oh, yeah. uh, yeah. uh, Give it to a bear! Damn, I'm a smart! Uh, <laughs> uh, I'm a damn Damn it! <laughs> is that Cartman? Is that Eric? Did he say Adama? Like yeah. Battlestar? Oh, yeah. <laughs> give it to the bear, yeah. Adama! You're gonna give it to the bear. Yeah. Yeah. Ooh, give it to the bear. Yeah. I, I, would love, I would love uh. two, three. Give it to the smirk. Just, just, just to have in ad libs, James Brown explain the entire plot of the series Battlestar Galactica as fast as you can, as fast as you can. That's a bonner. He Go gonna ahead. get it right. <laughs> You're gonna get it to him. Sounds too man time. Well, I know exactly what he's yeah, saying yeah. now. Yeah. Hold on, silence! <laughs> Let's have a plan! <laughs> it will be revealed! <laughs> All right, we have our final. <laughs> Woo! We have our actual final round here for five yeah. points. Five hours later. <laughs> they land on Earth! <laughs> <laughs> bam, bam, bam. Jordan, um, we're starting with you. Would you rather, would you rather start the human race <laughs> Or oh stop God. the human race. Oh, oh. Would I rather wow. have sex or commit genocide? <laughs> I mean, talk no, about I battle sex. More, more, yeah. more of a, a, a God level thing. So, like, you are either deciding to like snap your fingers and then there was life, Ooh. or you are snapping your fingers and ending the entirety of the. So, human so basically, experiment. we're asking like, pick a God. Would you rather be the creator? Or the ender, or the destroyer. Why and would I want to be the ender? Well, no, no, no. Well, remember, remember, it's more Twitter, fun. Twitter's you... voting on it, and nobody's on Twitter because they were having a good time before they got on Twitter. <laughs> <laughs> Number it's of true. people on Twitter who want to create things. No, nobody, nobody, nobody was like, "Fuck, man, this is the best day of my life." I gotta <laughs> log on to Twitter. <laughs> <laughs> what I and like is like, that. Fuck. <laughs> You. This shit sucks. My life sucks <laughs> shit. At least I've got Twitter uh, where everyone else is also miserable. I like that. And you thusly, I want to kill them all. <laughs> that feels depressing. I'm going to, I'm, because I care more about winning than I do having fun. <laughs> I'm going to pick start the human race because I truly believe that's what. He's so sincere. The Lord would want. Well, Pussy. okay. Uh, first of all, starting the human race, just picture all the humans all in a line, all the way up, and you're holding up that starter's pistol. One, and then you uh, get mm, to pull the trigger. The human and race. then they just Where run. They just <laughs> go. You get the start. That would be fun. Be more fun than having to stand uh, at the other end with a flag. As, as, you, as you pop open a natty light and light <laughs> like, a Marlboro Red and just stand at the starting <laughs> Knock him like, yeah, boys. Go ahead. <laughs> uh, I, that I, would be a better way to visualize God. I would go to church <laughs> if it was like, like, and then the human race was started and God just kind of fucked off. <laughs> yeah, uh, he's he's, he's like, kind of still day drunk right now. He's got like a cigarette. He's got a cell phone out. He's like, no, nobody likes me more than me. Well, that was day seven. Day seven, he was like, he was taking he's easy. like, everybody, he was setting it up for six days he's and he's like, 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 go, I'm on break. Yeah. <laughs> uh, Start don't hassle me, I'm local. Yeah. Uh, <laughs> for game theory alone, I have to go stop the human race. You're going to say stop? What's more, what's more fun than shooting a gun? Blowing a whistle. That's, yes, what I say. You're the winner of the human race. <laughs> You've done That's it. That's right. Well You'll done, my good it. and faithful runner, servant man. <laughs> it's me, the world's most obscure god. <laughs> oh, what's your name? Well, <laughs> I think you. you. <laughs> wow. Oh, wow. I guess you weren't that obscure after all. <laughs> well, you're you very famous I would have it figured out before I introduced my character, but here I am. And now I recede into the shadows once again until whoa, once whoa, again. Whoa, 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 hold on, hold on, hold on. So you were around the whole time? Well, yes, I didn't want to make a big deal. <laughs> were, you, just were, gonna you, were, you, were you hanging out on Earth? Or? Okay, I feel a little bit attacked right now. <laughs> no, 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 I'm sorry. You're just very <laughs> obscure. Very You're about to end the human race. I'm about, I'm about to not exist. So literally, this is just me asking my last questions. Okay. So, I, uh, yeah, yeah, where were you hanging out? My, uh, uh, oh, uh, Pluto. <laughs> Pluto. <laughs> yes. How how is it there? Cold. And what do you do? <laughs> <laughs> I 
spill my seed upon that celestial dwarf. So you <laughs> come on <laughs> Pluto? <laughs> You've spent the entire humanity coming on Pluto. Hold that thought. Okay. <laughs> I'm going to bring in my attorney, Bryce Castillo. <laughs> what the fuck? Yeah, I'm kind of... I've known Bryce for years. I didn't know that he was the personal attorney for the deity for whom we still don't have a name that has been the right. entirety of human race. And you race. never will. And then coming on Pluto. <laughs> Bryce, uh, approximately how many nuts has this man busted on this fucking... You uh, don't have to answer that. I don't pay you to answer. <laughs> I, I pay right. you to protect. I answered it. I answered it. I answered it. You and I'm here for you. That's right. <laughs> so you're I stopping. You're stopping the answers to the question. That's right. <laughs> well, then can I ask you how many nuts you bust? You cannot. <laughs> <laughs> this is not a free country. <laughs> <laughs> so uh, this is not a democracy. I'm ending this human race. Yeah. Uh, wait a minute, though. Wait a minute. Hold on, real, real quick. <laughs> okay, one more. Last episode of Seinfeld. Yes. What were your thoughts? <laughs> You know, television is a tricky business. <laughs> <laughs> and I think given the constraint. Oh, all right. All right. Justin, we are looking uh, to you. Would you rather start the human race or stop the human I gotta race? I got to go stop the human race. That's the only way I win. There we go. A lot of... Wait, uh, did, 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 did you just... Game you just theory, game theory me theory. out of... Yeah, there's no way you win. No matter what happens. I'm in the shadows no matter what. In the shadows. <laughs> <laughs> I'm not in the human race for real. Oh, yeah, race. Race. I only... Now I know what it feels like. <laughs> <laughs> All right. There we go. Uh, let's see. Justin and Brian said stop. Jordan said start. For five points and the game we were looking for. I'm going to shoot right to last place. Good night. So stop the human hey! Jordan, he's then too, he's Jordan, Jordan, oh, Jordan, man. then Jordan. Yeah. You're just yeah. taking advantage of the fact that I grew up in Virginia and don't know stuff. Oh, yeah. Hey, oh, I'm from Virginia. Exactly. I'm from Virginia. No, all the take, gods on Pluto. Right, take, we're from Virginia <laughs> also. Yeah, exactly. Yeah. We did it. You know we what? made it. We got a out. A lot of people don't know we got where out. I'm from. I got to go back to <laughs> right my name <laughs> You know, I made it for now. Uh, All right. Anyway, uh, uh, emails. Uh, if you've got an idea for a game or a letter or a comment, a high thought, any sort of thing, please send it in greatnightpod at gmail.com or uh, check the show notes wherever you're listening or watching. We would love to do another mailbag episode. We yes. can go a full hour and a half with your questions. Send, us, send stuff in. <sighs> I'm, I'm, I'm here for you. Send stuff do in. Do it. Yeah. Uh, Thank you. Hey, Jordan. Hey. Yeah. What the fuck are you doing here? <laughs> no, don't, don't. Well, now I don't know. <laughs> no, I no, thought no. I was. A but, guess. By, by the way, shockingly close to the first question I got on a certain podcast that is coming up. Which, which podcast? His podcast? No, no. The, oh, we, we talked about this when when they went on Pedulet's podcast. Oh my god, question well, was oh, pretty much that. Oh, yeah, no, okay. no, I was there. Yeah, yeah. I, okay, that's what I was referring. It doesn't matter. Yeah. Don't mind me. I'm in the shadows. <laughs> <laughs> Bust in another nut. No, can we? Can we? Can we? <laughs> I have graduated from Pluto to Earth to bust. <laughs> You've heard of the Dark Knight. Have you heard of the Dark Knight? <laughs> I have. No. I, you know what? I have heard of that one, actually. It's how I get my power. <laughs> <laughs> okay, I'm going to do some littering. You Please, no. Stay on your side of the planet, Batman. I will, I will, I will ingest you your, your seed. Batarang Become there, even right. more powerful. How do, how do you think I make my batarangs? Oh, I make my batarangs is this with what your cum. This is, yes. <laughs> I'll be looking at I am a cum obsessed uh, Karen Batman. Okay. <laughs> this is a fully formed character. Uh, so, uh, uh. Uh, so, Jordan. Before Jordan, you <laughs> ruined your career by coming on this show. Right. Uh, uh, how how did um, most Why? people know you uh, from if the videos on Cracked? What happened in the before time? BC, um, as it were. Yeah, in the before time. So I was a uh, music director at a church. Go on. Uh, the uh, natural springboard for all content. Right. Uh, for, for, I, uh, for... I stole the church's camera. Wait, um, for reals? <laughs> I mean, I gave it. 
back, but yeah, I, you bar- yeah, yeah, yeah. I borrowed it for a long time. <laughs> I'm, sure a bunch, I'm, I'm sure there's a bunch of stuff in the Bible where or somebody yeah, took yeah, somebody's yeah. spindle it's or like, something like, for a while. If indeed if the camera is a micro four thirds. <laughs> Then yeah, there's very specific technical, weeks. yeah, 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 cubits and stuff like that. Yeah, um, and basically what if happened? If the lens is legit, <laughs> you must acquit. <laughs> yes, I, I freaking love Deuteronomy. <laughs> um, and, and so that was the COVID happened, and I already had the camera because of COVID. <laughs> so we were you doing were stuff from home anyway. COVID in paradise. <laughs> My way into paradise was yes. going to ride that camera and COVID. To Valhalla. Um, and so uh, basically, uh, Cracked was sold to a new company and the YouTube channel was dormant. And I thought, I wonder if they want to reboot the YouTube channel. So I just filmed a video in my basement, well, a friend's basement, who was better with cameras than I was. And then we sent it to them and they said, why don't you d- do that for us forever, I guess. How, how, did how, you... how, how long ago was that? Uh, I pitched on March 16th, 2020. Which was day one of quarantine for us. Jesus Christ! Yeah, right? so yeah. I I actually didn't quite. I kind of stole the camera yeah. <laughs> a little early, but then I was able to justify retaining it because we were doing all these church all stuff. These videos. Yeah, 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 right. Um, and so uh, they accepted, and then I I made they 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 bought ten videos, and actually I called Brian because they were like, uh, "How much do you want for the first video?" And I was. I had no concept of what, what like, the bit. You know who yeah, I need yeah. to ask? <laughs> that dude who keeps coming on Pluto. <laughs> I was like, yeah, I get and paid in like, salvation. I'm emerging from the shadows. <laughs> Please value your own work as an artisan. Right. Uh, but, uh, uh, what was it like to, uh, I, I don't know, that moment where it's like, um, it takes a certain amount of audacity to yeah. just look at a dormant channel and be all like, I don't know, I can do it. <laughs> How hard can insightful commentary with witty banter and yeah, yeah. quality writing and shooting, production, editing, post-production, contract <laughs> management, dealing with subcontractors? Well, some of those things I didn't know about. Employee, employee. <laughs> How hard could it be? Well, that's the thing, too. When I pitched it, I sort of was trying to say I could be a writer for the day that you reboot it. But it was easier to just do the acting and the editing to to just give them a product without actually paying people or roping in a bunch of friends, especially once COVID hit. But they said, why don't you just do the whole thing? And I was like, that sounds good. And then I'm now learning what the whole thing is, which is all the things that you said. Yeah, sure. It's a, so, uh, I, I, you know, it's a little but, bit but, more but than that I thought. That moment of, uh, we talk about in uh, World's Greatest Con, how the con man, uh, the, the mark Am I has, con man by getting no, this no, no, job? No. Well, well yeah. you're, you're somebody who has that moment of surrender, right? Uh. You put all the effort into that first impression, you surrender it, and then you just have to wait. And like, like, what was that? How long was that waiting period? And what was that like? Oh, yeah, sure. So we actually, we filmed an episode in like January and it was, it was ass. It was total garbage. It was, <laughs> so the camera. You know what's funny is you said it was ass. And I'm like, so pretty good. Huh? <laughs> yeah. Dude, Brian, it was Brian. ass, bro. <laughs> Dude. You Brian, sh- Brian is so fucking aged out that it's just like, like, yes. Yeah, that's how <laughs> yeah. uh, I, I thought it was double ass. <laughs> Yo, twice the I ass, I dude. thought it was armpit and elbow combined. <laughs> yeah. Um, so if, if the camera's right here, we didn't really think about it. The teleprompter's over here. So the whole time I'm like, hey, <laughs> welcome to my show. Holy shit. It was a so, choice. It was a choice. Yeah, and nobody, we didn't think about it. We we did like four runs throughs of it i'm editing the content i'm like it looks so freaking stupid i realized well i I stumbled over the word because you were like we cuss a lot and i was like i don't know if i'm gonna cuss and then i was like should i say a swear (laughs) yeah you know what i think you should (laughs) shit oh Oh shit, my guy! This is the realest motherfucker. This dude is spitting like nobody has ever spit before. Ass. <laughs> <laughs> All right, um, okay, I, I don't know. So, so we filmed we filmed that. And it was garbage. So we actually filmed it. <laughs> we filmed it again, and I made sure to look into the camera at the camera. Right. And uh, uh, shoot, uh, we probably did that in February, and then I spent a month editing it, and then I, I actually kept. We we had like parties and I would be like, watch this and critique it and people were like, I don't give a shit. And I was like, okay, well, 
He's I'm hoping this will change my life. This, 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 <laughs> is, this is like the greatest uh, thing that we could actually like like share as pain is that whenever you are in a field in which you are doing art that is beyond a minute and a half, right? Getting anybody <laughs> to consume it so they can at least even tell you when they were bored and right. when it's bad is the hardest thing to do yeah. in the world. And you at least have visuals. Like when, when, when you're trying <laughs> right. to get people to listen to a fucking hour long podcast, right. it is like, you basically had to be like, you're my best friend and I need to have you promise me that you're going to listen to it tonight. And I know that it's not going to happen for another three months. Right? <laughs> yeah. Yeah. There, there was definitely in the early days of uh, raise the dead where you sent me a copy. You're like, Hey, I would appreciate it if you would listen to this and write down notes. So I listened to it and wrote down notes. And Justin was like, Holy shit, bro. Yeah. You know what you did? I was like, what? He's like, you listened to it. And, and you, you wrote, wrote down notes. notes. <laughs> I feel like, I actually feel, uh, that's something I always try and do for people because I know it's something that I want from everyone. So if anybody sends me a script, like if any of my friends do. At I, which email? <laughs> <laughs> Not anyone. Anyone yeah, oh, that I oh, got it. Yeah. hope to uh, uh, bum something off yeah. of someday. <laughs> yeah, if uh, you hope to profit off yeah, of it. Yeah, yeah, right. Uh, I, I, I usually do it. But then, so once we did that, once I released it, I heard back within... Like within 30 minutes, uh, I sent it to at the time. Well, he's still he's the managing editor of Cracked, Syriac Mar. Sent it to him. He sent me an email back in like 30 minutes. And then Colby, who is the uh, editor in chief of Literally Media, who owns Cracked, called me within like an hour. Holy crap! Yeah, that, it was... that's like it's like you're the first person to have Slimer as a ghost, <laughs> and then you called Cracked, and then somebody hit a button and said, "We got one." I know. Well, yeah, if, if if his story was Ghostbusters, it'd be a five minute short film. <laughs> yeah, with, with, with no bad ending. It would what? just it would just end with, and then they were great forever. Yeah, it was shockingly quick. And so I he he asked me then, and I had to. He's like, "Well, you know, what do you want for it?" I was like, "I don't know. I, I have no idea. Can I call <laughs> my uh, people? This is where they are. Yeah, yeah. Let me let me give you the old move I use." Let me consult my attorney, Bryce Castillo. Yeah, right. <laughs> what do I charge? Um, and the only question you can't ask me. <laughs> <Yeah>. <laughs> and uh, and so because it technically is a fucking salary negotiation. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> and uh, yeah, so uh, I I called you and we talked about it and we kind of settled on a thing and they said no and <laughs> so that I I worked it out and but 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 then you had that uh, that second part where it's like okay you made it onto the stage and then there's that moment that you press send. And you realize that your real bosses are not your boss bosses. Your real bosses are this this ravenous, the cynical horde right. that is screaming in the comments. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Uh, how 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 did that go? Um. So, but, hold on, but, but before we get any further, just for folks who are not familiar with your work, what kind of stuff do you do on the Crack Channel? So it's it's a little bit of everything now, but at the time it was exclusively one show. It was called Your Brain on Cracked, uh, which was a drug pun. Uh, that I came up with one day, and so I decided to tie. Well, yeah, right. So then I wore a doctor out. I was like, "Your brain on crack? That's drugs. I'll wear a doctor thing and be a doctor." That's how most drug dealers are. That's actually. <laughs> I don't. I don't know if you did that on purpose. That's the pilot episode. That's the first. Yeah. Oh, okay. Oh, oh, you're good. Uh, actually, and we reshot it a third time because I was still too ashamed of it. So, <laughs> um, that's the third take of that. But. Um, <laughs> Uh, <laughs> there's the there's that thousand memories. that thousand yard stare yeah, of like, somebody oh, who's seen God, some real God, shit. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> no, no, no. That that's I mean, like, especially when you work on stuff that is supposed to be and, and YouTube and podcasts are similar in that like the final product has very little room for any error because like like the the bar of professionalism is so high. Yeah. That it's like not a single little, um, uh, yeah, any, not a any, single any, whoopsie any little doodle. Bit, like uh, any element of Humanity needs to be very intentional mm -hmm. that, that you're that you're leaving in. So I, I well, very it, much appreciate. What, well, what you know, it's a channel there. that much way existed before me that had tons of people working on it, had great budgets, had great equipment, had hilarious writers and actors and all this stuff. And I, you're right, the audacity to be like, I get, it'll be like kind of the same thing, but there's two of us in a basement. So we we spent a lot of time being like, how can we make it look halfway decent? Are we just to trick people enough to get mad at the content. <laughs> yeah. And not be like, how can we make this yeah. look like seven overpaid NYU grads did it? <laughs> right. Uh, pro tip blue curtains, a big <laughs> diamond club symbol, and a TV. <laughs> right. 
Yeah, fuck you, Tish School. <laughs> um, it's a good light. It is. Yeah. So, uh, you know, so whatever. We made it. And then, uh, yeah, people, I, I, it actually ended up being a little bit fortuitous. I knew that people were going to get pissed. Um, they were going to think that, like, I had fired everybody way back in 2017. With the time machine. With the time she machine. Even where though it was... you actually go back in time and read and, and fire I just everyone do it. crap. Yeah. Yeah, that would. I think people. So, so I mean, because uh, I, I don't really know the history of of, of cracked. Like, I know that it is a it been a troubled property. I know that I was a subscriber when I was uh, yeah, yeah. thirteen to a magazine. <laughs> yep. I know it right. then became a website for which had a very distinctive style of uh, historical analysis mm-hmm. and well researched and well written snark. Uh, I then assume that along that with that heyday came a similar YouTube channel. Yeah, exactly. And then like most media empires, uh, especially in the internet era, it just um, overnight went bust. It get went sold, from, get like, sold, get yeah, sold, it, get it, sold. It, so it went from a gigantic steam train that was heading to the moon to butterflies <laughs> immediately. Yeah. So apparently it was like 2016. It sold to EW scripts, I believe for like 38, 34 million dollars, like a pretty a good little chunk. Yeah. And then within about a year, by the end of 2017, EW Scripts fired every single person on the video team, um, most of the editors and the writers and stuff. And so uh, I I had been trying to get a job there. I was freelance writing for them. I even like flew down to L.A. and and said, oh, my wife and I are here just on our anniversary, just hanging out. Do you we mind were if just we... walking down the yeah, street, we... <laughs> good yeah. sir. We just found ourselves in Charlottesville after, or uh, yeah. in uh, Santa <laughs> oh, Monica Pier. Charlottesville. Yeah. You know, L.A. feels so much like home, I might have <laughs> <Yeah>. spoke. <Yeah. laughs> uh, we were just the... looking at uh, Dean Martin's star on the Walk of Fame <laughs> when we found ourselves here at yeah. the cracked headquarters. Yeah, and so I like tried to get in, and I met some people, and then they were all fired within three months I was like, well <laughs> so, so it didn't work it, in that chaotic <laughs> gap Hollywood what's your dream <laughs> yeah. uh, uh, in that gap between launching uh, uh, there had to have been some moment that you strongly suspected like oh I, I think I'm winning them over uh, like do, uh, was well, there a particular bit of feedback that you got yeah, um, well what I was gonna say the the thing that ended up being cool so I was just freelancing so I was just sending videos and they were doing thumbnails and they were doing everything I was just hoping for the best I, I wrote on my blog uh, just a, a thing to try and explain where I was coming from, that I wasn't, it wasn't like uh, I had been doing this a lot. I was, I was still actively a music <laughs> minister at a church. Like I'm not, I, I don't know, somebody that they, they scalped or like poached from somewhere else or anything. And uh, I wrote a little thing and I just, I tried to throw it into the comments in the hopes that like three people would read it and be less mad. But Colby actually penned it to the top. And so a lot of people read it, and there were a ton of comments that were like, I originally wished that you would die, um, <laughs> but I have read your thing, and I am less inclined to hope for your death. And I was like, sincerely, God. <laughs> yeah. And so uh, right off the bat, there were, there were uh, more people that gave me a shot than I would have expected. And even at the time, um, people that know the Crack Channel, Michael Swaim hopped in there and yeah. was very kind, Daniel O'Brien and Soren and, and a few other people on Twitter were saying, chill out. That's fine. Also, they're all like winning Emmys and shit now. So like they're not super worried about it, probably. Um, but uh, and so, you know, that trajectory, it, it would happen every week. We were doing it every Friday. Uh, a bunch of people tell me to die. And then about half of them would edit. I read your thing and I less want you to die. And then, you know, well, eventually that, that, all that's the... also like, like you were you are dealing with two <clears throat> totally contradictory but immutable laws of the Internet, yeah. which is one we want more. Right. <laughs> and B, we hate change. Right. Yeah. So you were giving them more, but you were also change. Right. And and so there is always going to be that element of like, hooray, more of the thing that I liked. Like, yes, but it's different. Right. Uh, fuck. God damn it. Like, yeah, yeah. There's a thing. Oh, a new crack video. Oh, yeah. Oh, but it's different. <laughs> like, oh, fuck. I hate it. But it's there. Yeah. Oh, shit. Oh, wait. It's a new one. Oh, a new crack video. Oh, but I fucking but, hate this yeah. cunt. 
I just want to listen to this for twelve more hours. Yeah, I mean, this that is my literally yeah, the internet. Yeah, yeah. This, is, this is this is like 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 the 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 spine cracking of the internet. Like as as, yeah. as, as real as the wind that the, you hear when you walk out of your fucking door. That is what. Oh uh, yeah, there's is. a there's a thing. I made a thing. Please don't hate me for it. And so I I tried to explain it, and eventually, you know, it's been two years now, and so you you sort of get to the point where the truly angry, toxic people unsubscribed. Eventually, we lost almost every single video. It would like a thousand subscribers would disappear, and then it would over the course of time and slowly. Back up. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Um, as, That's one of the counterintuitive things where it's <clears> like no matter how many people you have, uh, the audacity again to to bother to do anything will <laughs> right. shed some number of people. Yeah. that were committed. Yeah, for example, like on the Scam School Scam Nation channel, uh, 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 shocker, people get into magic and then they stop being into magic. And then all of a sudden, magic shows up in their feed, and they say, "I am no longer into magic." Right. So, sure. like, there's some amount of, of 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 churn that happens. Yeah, yeah. And so, uh, and we had that. Plus, they hated they hated me and wished I died. You personally, <laughs> yeah. No, there yeah. is that. And that yeah. was yeah. you yeah. also <laughs> stuck. Like, I would like to end the and human and yeah. race <laughs> and defeat yeah. you in a game, which yeah. is which is just like that's ten percent of the internet. Ten percent of the internet is just there to hate you yeah yeah very and, personally uh, for for various reasons like, yeah but I, I mean eventually we we you know a, a lot of those people left we added new people the people that hung around liked it and we started doing things i got hired full-time three months later and so we started doing things like somebody mentioned honest ads i i brought honest ads back by doing a bunch of google foo i was just like trying to find his name and i found a writer that had interviewed him and then i got her Wait, the email to, from him to find the guy they didn't even have his name in the rolodex well no they don't have any i mean they we have a bunch it of was, hard it was done. drives yeah they have a bunch of hard drives from the old company but because that's the thing is ew scripts then sold it again got it. to literally media which is why i pitched it because i i wasn't going to pitch to ew scripts like hey i know you killed everybody but like i'm coming back <laughs> um, I do that? so i th i thought a new company surely part of the deal was they wanted to reboot this channel and so anyway um you know, we had Michael Swain back on for a video, which was really fun. And, you know, so we've, we've tried to build it back as best we can. And I mean, clearly you're doing fantastic. Uh, as a matter of fact, uh, <laughs> to, to round things out, what is the one video, if people want to give your content to try, that you like to recommend? Um, if it's me specifically, I would say uh, I got tied up in a basement until I explained the entire Saw movie timeline. So done saw cracked yes uh, it's absurdly long it's an hour and 15 minutes but i'm oh, literally so many viewer minutes <laughs> mm, um, yes so many programmatic ads yeah. oh. i wonder i wonder yeah. how many kickstarters and chill ups i'll learn about <laughs> yeah yeah there's there's me tied up uh in dave's mom's basement uh i was very excited that we found an old mad uh magazine book well, oh, that's uh, amazing for yeah. for the background. Yeah, we were just going through his mom's basement. So Dave is the guy that uh, he makes all of my videos with me. Uh, you know, uh, uh, <laughs> <laughs> it's it's a oh, really holy fun shit! Video. So the, it, it's a big hardbound mad book. Yeah, I, I, it, it, we were just in his mom's basement, and he, I was like, "Time into that pole, Dave." That's amazing. And then, so so mad versus correct. So the mad people would be part part of me yeah, wants to yeah, see if amazing. we can uh, set up a cameo for uh, Dick DiBartolo, uh, where he's just like, uh, "You're like I've cracked." He's like, "Not a fan," <laughs> you know, or something like that. Um, and so anyway, that's it. But I mean, if you want to see the like my favorite things that we make, we did like. Uh, the Batman for twenty dollars recently. Yeah, so we, they we sweet, sweeted it. Sweet trailers. Yeah, yeah. yeah, and then um, you know we do all these honest ads, which is a, a legacy show that we used to do. Like um, we did if NFTs were honest. Well, for example, you can add to your list of achievements one thing and then knock it onto the ground, and that's winning the game at Great Night. Yes. I didn't though. I he lost. Did. He didn't. I won. I, I know. That's why I'm saying you could add it to the shelf and then knock it to the ground. Oh yeah. That's let's see. So he wants to be dishonest, but then immediately rejected. <laughs> yes, correct. Yeah. All right. I might have started the sentence and then realized <laughs> what I was saying. <laughs> because you were correct. It's all you were Mr. Castillo, Mr. Castillo. Uh, objection! <laughs> right. Sustained!
Uh, Brett, what did we learn tonight? We have learned that Bryce Castillo is the world's greatest lawyer. Oh, I'm here for you. <laughs> we, we've learned that there is a God who is constantly coming on a planet, not a planet, a planet boy. No, I think it is a, planet, a celestial yeah. dwarf. It's fine. Isn't it a planet again? It's not a planet. Still? No. no it went back. Intimidated? You Damn. can't find me. Thanks, Neil. We, we <laughs> Neil. That George That's my name. Doesn't That's quite I never know. said that was my name. Oh my God! You're Neil deGrasse Tyson. <laughs> <laughs> you're the one who's been coming on Pluto this I entire time. I, I deny nothing. I mean, I knew you were annoying, but this annoying. Okay. Do you want to hear my opinions about the movie Gravity? No. <laughs> okay. This I is will... scientifically not possible. Yeah. yeah. <laughs> I have a lot of questions about your college relationships. <laughs> Banish Jesus Christ. And we've learned that when a bit starts, you just get the fuck out of the way. <laughs> I do do that. Oh, uh, uh, man, uh, we I love you guys. How do we end the show again? Uh, well, first, we thank our guests. Thank you very much, Jordan Breeding. Everybody thank check out Crack.com. You can read some of Jordan's articles on themodernrogue.com. Thank you to our pre-show guest, Jen Briney of Congressional Dish. Sister 9-11. Sister 9-11. And, uh, of course, the co-host of the new We're Not Wrong podcast. Coming soon. Wait, uh, it's did, available. Did you just announce a brand new podcast on this podcast? I don't know. Did I? <laughs> Shine on, you crazy diamonds. <laughs> Still a great night. Still a great night. Club hopes you have enjoyed this program. <laughs>